In Midtown Detroit, there is a nonprofit working to help break the stigma of mental health and mental illness. And they're using art to do it. Everod Kasimi shows us how the Children's Center is tapping into creativity and getting some real results. I actually have a painting I haven't finished yet. It was kind of like a mural type thing. Uh, it's like a collection of buttons. 16 year old Erin Walls is putting the finishing touches on a piece of artwork. She's making it here at the Children's Center in Detroit, a place she spent the past three years creating art as therapy. I was not in the best place in my life. Um, my mentality and my self-worth was not good. I was suicidal. The news came as a surprise to Aaron's mother, Christine, who had brought her other daughter to the Children's Center to get help dealing with bullies at school. I didn't know she was going through some things that saved Aaron life because I had no idea that she was even attempting or trying or how many times that she tried. And the day that we came, I found out that that day, the day before, she had even attempted to try to kill herself. Aaron got involved in art therapy because she was able to express herself creatively. It made all the difference. All the suicidal thoughts that she had, she communicates with me. She talks to me. She tells me what she's going on. If she's having a rough time, she draws it out and she hands it to me and says, here, mom. Art can give them an opportunity to have a voice. And that's just what therapists here at the Children's Center encourage their clients to do. For Erin, it's a family affair. And these are some of the pieces of art that children here at the Children's Center have done for therapy. This last piece on the wall was done by Erin, her siblings, and her mom. The first piece of artwork that they've done together as a family. And it's not just painting. Erin and other children have made these pieces hanging from the ceiling, as well as origami. They encourage other children dealing with mental health issues to try art therapy as a way to cope. I'm still working for some things, but I'm definitely way better than I was. Everett Cassidy, Local 4.